living in 2018. This boy living in 3018. What is he doing? He literally hung up his scooter in the bus to make a seat. All the other seats were taken. Somebody get this boy a scholarship. I just really hope he doesn't hurt himself. This kid though. <laughs> oh, he like hung up his phone by the wire so he could watch movies. I mean, the airport floors probably aren't that clean. I'd say the only thing more dirty is probably the bathroom floor. But I gave him an A plus for creativity and laziness. <laughs> Cause we all got a little bit of laziness inside of us. And that bit of laziness appreciates this. Guys, 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 somebody finally found a good purpose for that little table thing that comes with our pizza. I mean, as a kid, I used to pretend as a table, but now as an adult, I'm just like, what is the use of this? But now there is a use. They put little tiny hot sauces in them and they're delicious and cute. I love them. Mm. I love tiny miniature anything. Tiny anything, I'm like, ho, oh, oh. ho. Tiny chairs down, tiny. Why can't I think of anything else? I have no idea what this thing is, but uh, imagine this guy just pulling up. Is this a police officer? I think this might be a police officer. Maybe that thing goes really fast. He's all like... <laughs> All over the place. I was at church today and this guy legit had a hollowed out Bible with his iPhone and don't kill me. Rolling Instagram while everybody else sang. <laughs> wow, this guy is a rebel. This guy doesn't care what anybody thinks. I feel like, okay, I feel like personally, I would be way too afraid that somebody would tell me off. Like, I feel like people would be judging me. I don't have the balls to do this. Then I, I, I got pretty big balls. <laughs> like, theoretically, like, not, not literally. Like, I, you guys get what I mean. This newswoman, I give her props. She's like, I don't need no cameraman. Just give me a selfie stick and his salary and I'll do the rest. I'm not hating. Let the girl hustle. This is proof that literally you can do anything. You don't need much. All you need is a selfie stick and you can do anything. Give a woman a selfie stick and she can conquer the world. <laughs> so beautiful. Is this guy marrying his wife? through vr i got so many questions are there laws for this is this legal where is everybody else at his wedding i feel bad now don't worry you're not alone me and all the azylanders watching this we watching your wedding and we're a little like confused but we're here for you <laughs> Is he marrying an anime character possibly? Because if so, I called dibs on Vegeta. Called it. He's mine. Back off everybody else. What? I always thought those things were just to cover your eyes from the sun. But they can be iPad holders. Don't sue me if your iPad falls and breaks. But you get to watch amazing movies. Was that not worth it? Okay, maybe not worth it. These people turned their coffee lid into an iPhone holder. So now when you're drinking your coffee, you can just watch whatever you want. Like my YouTube videos. Do it. Imagine you just see some dude at a restaurant using VR. Does he have a virtual girlfriend there? We don't know. Is he sitting on a tropical beach in his VR? We don't know. We'll never know because only he can see what's on his VR. I'm really curious though. Like, dude, what are you looking at? Share it with the world. Now they need VR headsets where like on the outside you can see what people are watching. That way the whole world can enjoy. I guess that's a little invasive. How awkward would it be though to be his waitress and you're just trying to like find out if he's enjoying the food like, uh, did you like that, sir? He's like, like, uh huh. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to think maybe he's on a virtual date because he has two of the drinks, two of the bowls. I think he's on a virtual date. Detective Assy has figured this out. We're all in 2017, I mean 2018. Well, Chick fil A is in 40. 27 they far ahead in the future because they've made the gap in the handles so big that you don't have to touch it with your hands anymore now you can just use your arm to open up the door handles who here doesn't touch door handles and they use their hands or their feet or whatever you're using i mean i don't use my feet because that just makes it worse but i do use my arm but then when you think about it the germs are still getting on your arms like it's not really helping mentally maybe it's helping like it's helping me a little no it's not helping me at all i still got germs everywhere these women are innovators. They're like, we don't want to hold our drinks. So they just knitted their wine glasses to themselves. I mean, I'm living for it. I'm, I'm all about a hands-free life. This kid doesn't have a Bluetooth headset. He made it work though. Not gonna lie, I actually saw somebody doing this yesterday. I was riding my bike and there was some girl riding her bike and she had it put in her hat too. And I was like, girl, aren't you afraid that's gonna fall out while you're riding your bike? Like it did not seem secure, but she was just like, <laughs> 
riding her bike and talking on her phone. And I was like, that is one brave girl. In 1903, we had the first powered human flight. In 1946, we had the first computer activated. In 1969, man set foot on the moon. But in 2017, we got this. We really are living in the future. Now our action figures can oh, be jacked AF. Remember I was talking about Vegeta earlier? Pretty sure this is Goku. Back off my man. 1970. I bet they'll be flying cars in the future. 2018. We've come so far. I don't have to have cheesy fingers anymore. I mean, if I didn't like that. <laughs> you know I like a good cheesy finger because after you have a cheesy finger, you can be that disgusting person. And I am that disgusting person who licks it off and it is so good. I don't care if it's disgusting. I love licking the cheese off my fingers. It is the best part. The worst part is that afterwards your fingers are orange forever. But at least I got to lick that cheesy goodness. This guy is FaceTiming boiling water from the other room. So he doesn't have to watch it boil, but he can still see when it's boiling. Honestly, I'm blown away. This guy, genius. Genius. Can we get a genius here? He's a genius. I mean, he's a little bit lazy, but he's a genius. He's a lazy genius. This guy taking selfies in 3018. How? How he do this? I can barely take one with my hands without dropping my phone on my face or on the floor. This guy's using his toe. Honestly, can we get this guy an award or at least a cookie? Get this guy a cookie. What? This is amazing. Instead of having the TV on the wall, one person has his unfair advantage because their field is going the right way. Now, you guys can both be going the right way. I like this. Does this actually work though? Like I imagine one person's controls would be off, right? Because you're playing upside down. So your left would be right and your right beat would be left. Can we do this with Fortnite? Let's flip our TVs. Fortnite isn't this type of game. You totally can't do this with Fortnite. <laughs> can't speak. Stutters. This is Speak Out. It's a funny game where you put this guard in your mouth and I don't actually know because I haven't actually played, but I've heard it's funny. You put this thing in your mouth and then you play a game and it's supposed to be really funny because this is what you look like. You literally look a, a little... A, a, a little strange without being mean a little strange but this guy figured out that it's also great for flossing because you know how hard it is to reach your back teeth two in one game game flosser my sister out here in 3017 she's using the cup holder as a burrito holder now i don't drive too much but that was before i figured out that cars had burrito holders you know i'm gonna be driving a lot more now because there's a place to put my burrito that was the problem all along i just had nowhere for the burrito my life is better now <laughs> i mean sometimes in some countries it gets hot you know it gets hot you get sweaty this guy's like i'm not gonna be sweaty no more but you're gonna be wet gotta fight the heat somehow is this fashion now guys i mean <laughs> It's a phone holder and a waxing kit all at one. Yay! I'm not down and I don't think you guys should do this either, but hmm, I'm not here to judge. This is awesome. Now, you're not gonna burn yourself in some noodles because you have a fan cooling them down right before they enter your mouth. Delicious! My dog hates his nails getting clipped, so my dad literally bought a purse and cut holes into it. Hope that purse ain't Gucci. Next time I get a mani petty, this is the type of treatment I want. I wanna hang from a purse, and it better be Gucci. This girl is living in 3017 because she just used a clothing hanger to seal a bag of chips. My chips always getting stale when the solution was here all along. I look at things like this and I'm like, why didn't I think about this? It's so simple, but clearly not simple enough because I didn't think about it. We're here worrying about smartphones. This guy already in 3017 with a holster for his hot sauce. <laughs> you <laughs> never know when you're gonna need that hot sauce. Never know. This guy took Netflix and chill to another level. He has his laptop somehow attached above his bathtub. So he'd be taking a bubble bath and watching, I don't know what he's watching, I can't tell, but he's watching something and he's enjoying it. This honestly is giving me a little bit of a heart attack because that does not look secure. It looks like that laptop is about to go. That was me trying to imitate a bathtub. I'm not very good at this, okay? Imitations are not my thing. This dude living in 3017. Legit, he made a chair out of sand. That looks so comfortable. I need to buy it. Ikea, who? Now this, I can get behind. This McDonald's has a step and pull on their bathroom doors. Remember that other bathroom door with your hand? No, 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 I'm not about that. I'm about this. This needs to be on every public washroom door. I'll start funding it myself. That's how much I don't like bacteria. 
bacteria you ain't getting me today this is in amsterdam i recognize this i've been here so i just get really excited when i see things that i, I like recognize and i'm like oh, 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 oh anyways back back to the video this dude attached his suitcase to his backpack and is just pulling it this is brilliant hands free people i'm all about it we have another picture of scooter boy i love this i love this so much it's amazing i'm also a little scared of it but ugh, i need to try this it looks fun i feel like you could swing anyways guys i'm gonna go eat i hope you guys get to eat soon too i love you all so much stay awesome stay sweet and don't forget to be nice other.